Now to hurricanes. The fact is the tropics have been pretty quiet for weeks now, but we are just getting into what longtime residents know is the peak of our hurricane season. And today, experts at the National Hurricane Center hosted what they called a prediction update. Our Michelle Pedraza here now with what they said. Michelle? Well, Joe, the National Weather Service says that NOAA predicts an increased chance for more active season. NOAA hosted the second prediction update monitoring the Atlantic and Pacific climate pattern to see if we're going to have either an above, below, or normal hurricane season. They now predict to see 10 to 17 storms, five to nine hurricanes and two to four major hurricanes. A big variable that affected this year's season is El Nino, which causes warmer water temperature in the Pacific and stronger winds across the Atlantic. More our hurricanes form, and so those stronger winds tend to reduce the number of storms that we see because hurricanes don't like wind shear. METS ADDS THAT THERE IS A BIG INCREASE IN TROPICAL ACTIVITY DURING LATE AUGUST. SEPTEMBER IS THE ABSOLUTE PEAK MONTH FOR THE TROPICAL ACTIVITY IN THE ATLANTIC BASIN. AND HURRICANE SEASON ENDS IN NOVEMBER. THE SERVICE DOES SAY THAT THESE ARE ONLY PREDICTIONS AND THAT A MAJOR HURRICANE CAN HIT IN ANY TYPE OF SEASON, QUIET, NORMAL, OR ACTIVE. AND THEY ALWAYS ADVISE NO MATTER WHAT TO ALWAYS BE PREPARED. JOE. ALL GOOD ADVICE. MICHELLE, THANKS.